What up, me bags? Deanbot the Machine Bot here. Welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 4. All right, still deep in the midst of the castle here, trying to figure out which way is up, down, left, and right. We were set upon by Salazar and ambushed by his minions. So far, we're doing pretty good about fighting off said minions. Somehow, I mean, the bugs were way worse than these dudes, that's for sure. Security system is active. I have to deactivate it first. Okay. This then? Looks like a security system of some sort. Let's deactivate it. I don't know. Well, that seems fancy. Nah, nah, you two again. Nope. No, thank you. <laughs> he really doesn't care about the property damage, does he? <laughs> There's a switch. I will press it. And that leads me out to the big blue chest. I'll probably pop up those dudes again. Oh, God. You dicks. Man, nothing makes you nearly shit out your heart like seeing RPGs pointed at you. What do we have here? Ah, one of the ornaments. That's to move forward from a door that was in the main chamber. Alright, that was pretty hectic, so let's go ahead and throw a save on here. <clears throat> at the same time, I managed to find some extra magnum bullets, so I'll definitely end up using that at some point. There's something truly beautiful about a magnum. Two doors. We always get the two doors. One must be locked while the other must not. That one is definitely locked. Though I don't know why he wouldn't just look at it and be like, hmm, this door is locked, instead of kicking the crap out of it. There we go. A spinal, very nice. I still got two rounds I can use from this. Then we'll stick with the pistol for a bit. Considering how things have been going in the castle lately, though, I'm going to go ahead and equip this. We'll conserve some sniper ammo. Because if we get more of the enemy snipers or more people trying to plug us from a distance, that thing's going to be necessary. Ooh. All sorts of velvet blue and spinels inside the fountain. It's locked from the other side. With a little help from another person, I might be able to get it. Ah. So I need help from another person to get in there. Okay. I'll try to remember to come back here. Flame grenade. Very nice. Helps clear out those big cl and big clusters for sure. Well, this looks like a lovely garden. here. Won't open. There's an indentation here. Two moons make one. Must be what a couple of the chests down here are. Must be the key to move forward. So, oh, 
<clears throat> Salazar calling to taunt me again. Mr. Kennedy. Still alive, I see. Yeah, I'm stubborn. So, do you like my garden? It's, so you've it's pretty nice. A little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am, even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, you'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. God. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to tie up a few loose ends. Other than me? Down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? Indeed. They're an intruder besides me? I do remember seeing a lady in red. All right, so what kind of pets do you have in here? Because if it's more of those bugs, I'm just going to be unhappy. Hmm, could be dogs. There were dogs earlier in the game. If it's dogs, shotgun would be the better bet here for sure. It's dogs. I don't care for that notion one bit, Billy. There's three of them. Sorry, Poochies. Sniper rounds. They are all about giving me sniper rounds, aren't they? So there's still more, huh? Shotgun shells, I'll gladly take. Holy crap! Okay. SMG rounds, always nice. I'll never say no to ammo. Oh, that's one of the halves. Very good. Very good. So they're at the fountains. Jesus Christ! Get off me! Where did he come from? Thank you for waiting patiently. So many of these damn things.
Sweet. Gladly take another yellow herb. But I could use some red. Don't care for that. I'm pretty quiet all of a sudden, hadn't it? Not that I'm complaining, if that's really the end of them, I'll be ecstatic. Another first aid spray. Nice. Just gotta get back to that door. Nope, nope, I'm, I'm wrong. Wrong! I gotta go back through the double doors over here. Hi ya! There we go. Two moons make one, so I need to combine these guys. Not you. Combine and use. Bam! Sweet! Ooh, bullets. The lady in red. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. So strict. Woo! How are you talented? Bit of advice. Try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. Indeed. Ada. Thought you were dead. So it is true. True? About what? You. Working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Wesker? Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> Flashbang sunglasses. Fancy. See you around. Ada. So Wesker's alive too. I feel like there should be more explanation, since in the remake, Ada was falling to her death, and Wesker was had his guts torn out by a tyrant in the first game. So, <laughs> I feel like there's some explanations that need to be made. The unfortunate part is, it doesn't really dive into that information all that much. 
Eight is alive. That's it. And Wesker's alive. That's it. Granted, Wesker is a special case, considering he injected himself with the T-Virus. Or was it the G-Virus? I don't remember which one. A mirror with pearls and rubies. That'll sell. The female intruder. There seems to be a female intruder among us. We believe she's connected with Sarah. We also believe that she was the one who removed the egg injected into Sarah before it hatched. She may have had him retrieve the sample before the American agent's arrival. It's obvious that her objective is the sample. We must get to her before she is able to reestablish contact with Sarah. There's also reason to believe that she's working for somebody. We need her alive for interrogation. The female should be able to answer all our questions. After we have captured her, Sarah will no longer be of any concern. As long as we retrieve the sample, you may dispose of him as you see fit. So they're after both Ada and Luis. Oh, hello, Magnum Rounds. Nothing says eat a dick like putting a Magnum Round in someone's face. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. Ah, lucky when you have things on sale. Let's see. We can get rid of these <laughs> and these. <laughs> Thank you. We can sell you this. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> I figured you would. Thank you. What are you buying? What you got for my Is upgrades? <laughs> Thank you. Is that? <laughs> that Is that old? <laughs> Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. Still another firepower that can be upgraded. That should be all I can do for now. Excellent. Come back any time. Now let's see here. Yeah, we are packed full here. My goodness. So my shotgun's running a little low on ammo, so we'll switch to the pistol for the time being. Actually, I'm going to switch to this for the time being. I do have some spare room. It gives me space enough for one more little twofer right here, so let's pistol whip this for a bit. I get plenty of rounds for one magazine in the pistol, so may as well. Till I use the grenade launcher, which I will be using here soon. If memory serves me correctly, anyway. Shotgun shells. A desert to cherish our remaining years. A desert. Did I say desert? I said desert. I'm a dumbass. There we go. Now, how about some red herbs? Bread begins the meal of life. Hmm. Meat to savor the time at hand. What is all this? One last drink and the bottle breaks, returning us to the dust from whence we came. That's kind of weird. Okay. Hope whatever's in here was worth it. Oh, it was a trap. I should have known better. Oh, God. Okay, this just got for real deal.
I am totally screwed, ain't I? Oh, that's fucking fair! Are you serious? Go fuck yourself, game! Fuck you in every regard! I mean, there's literally nothing you can do, dude. That is some bullshit. Are you fucking with me? What the hell am I supposed to do in that scenario? I'm not giving up. I'm trying this again. Or don't kick, sit there and stare at him. That helped. Jesus. First and foremost, fuck you. even in here. Nothing very worth it. Okay. Now then. Why do you assholes keep popping in here? Fine with me if you want to keep walking away. God damn, how are there more of you still? That's right. <sighs> mm. 
getting my money's worth out of this bullshit. All that just for an hourglass. God. I don't know if that was worth it. <laughs> Completely forgot about that part. Another herb, huh? No choice. Okay. Ah, you bloody snake! How in the hell? I can't hit it! Damn it! This sucks! Thank you! That took way more than it should have! I'm gonna start double swinging at boxes just so I can break that shit! Friggin' snakes, man. here was there something different I got that made it so I could go well just the goat head thing I guess that's something but is it really the something I hmm I don't know if that's really the way I need to go or not We're going to double back real quick because I am having conflict. There was another door here. Okay, so it wasn't just about the hourglass then. Whew. All right. Damn, that's creepy. See, it's locked. That's an RPG in there. Well, son of a bitch. Man, I swear, with the knowledge I keep dropping out of my head, I didn't even have to buy an RPG. I could have gone and grabbed one. Well, damn. Hopefully nobody holds a grudge on me over that.
Oh. Cool. Get another one here in a minute anyway. <laughs> Now we gotta find our way to that because I really don't want it to go to waste. Now, dick move, bro. Coming for that ass. Seriously? Fucker. Thing I needed. Wait, wait. Yeah, I've got like a supreme amount of rounds for this, so I'm gonna stick with this for a sec. So I apologize to anybody who went and bought the rocket launcher at the same time I did, even though there was one you were easily gonna be able to get your hands on later. Well, the bright side being, I will still be able to show you where the best place to use it is. Man, you get around, don't you? Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What do you, what do you have? Oh, the supersized attache case. You know I'm saving up for it, buddy. What are you selling? Well, we're gonna get rid of these. Is that all, <laughs> Is that all strange? <laughs> Thank you. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. I'm tempted, but I'm gonna hold on. We need seventy-three thousand to get that big guy, so we're gonna hold off on upgrading anything or purchasing anything else till I can get the supersized attache case. Because that extra bag space is incredibly helpful. Ah, Leon, Luis. I got it. Huh. What happened? Oh! Oh shit! Luis. So that's what everyone's making a big deal of, huh? Oh man, yeah, Luis is dead. What the hell? Oh, that is an inappropriate use of that, now sir. That I have the sample. You serve me no purpose. Sadler! My boy Salazar will make sure you follow the same fate. Son of a bitch. Me, I am a researcher. 
hired by Sadler. He found out what I was up to. <laughs> Don't talk. Yeah, it doesn't matter if he talks or not, dude. He's finished. It should suppress growth of the parasite. The sample. Sadler took it. You have to get it back. Lewis! Lewis! Well, that sucks. Right when he finally caught up with me. They'll pay for your death. Ashley. Surprised you kept quiet after hearing everything that happened up here. So this is the part where I'm going to need to rely on the snipe hair. Cause that's what happens when Ashley gets in trouble. You need to cover her with sniper fire. Actually, can't can't take those sniper bullets. Well, we'll hold off on breaking anything else then, cause maybe more sniper bullets will be acquired. It's okay. I'm coming, Ashley. No, calm down. There. Talk about near death experience. It gets worse. The or just cower in one spot. That helps. That guy will have a key. There you go. Yeah, get moving. Whew. Oh, now I gotta play as her? Well, crap, that means I got no guns. And she's super squishy. Oh, everything about this sucks. Let's go ahead and hit up a save because I get the feeling I'm gonna have to do this a couple of times. Thank you. care for this notion one bit. Yeah. 
Duh. Well, she's got ways of fighting back at least. Eat it. Doesn't seem to matter how often I do it, though, does it? Ah, so three is the limit, huh? Of course. Well, there's an idea. Taking your sweet time, huh? That's right. You can stay in there. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Takes so long to do that. For now, though, I'm going to combine these. Because if I manage to get a complete concoction, I'll be able to give it to Leon. I know her health is important too, but as long as my health is up there, she won't fall to any harm. Alright, let's get this opened up. And now I see the point of leveling up her health because they put you in this scenario. Excellent. What's this? Butler's Memo. Knowing that Sir Ramon Salazar had no family, Lord Sadler must have used his strong faith in the Los Illuminados to his advantage to talk Sir Salazar into un doing the seal of the Las Plagas, once done by his ancestor. Sir Salazar would never do such a thing unless he was in some way being used unknowingly. I should have sensed the Lord's dirty scheme sooner. I feel I'm partially responsible for all of this. I have no idea as to what the Lord is planning, but Sir Salazar was just being used. It is too late now, however. Sir Salazar has already taken the Plaga into his body. There's no turning back once the plaga has turned into an adult in the body. The plaga parasite will not die unless the host dies. There's no cure. Perhaps Sir Salazar may have been vaguely aware of the Lord's plan all along, but it's hard to tell. Nevertheless, there's nothing I can do about it now. I have served the Salazar family for generations. I am prepared to continue my services until the very end. A loyal butler, although misguided. Round hole in the center. So it looks like I need to get something here. Hey, I feel a draft from down here. Maybe there's a secret passage on the other side. Hmm. So I have to find that item first. Some ammo. She may not be able to use ammo, but she can collect stuff for Leon, so that's pretty cool. Alright. Ah, I get a flashlight. 
How do you like them apples? Ah. Oh, cool. Okay. So it's one of those little puzzle deals. Crawl on through here. Ah, good. Ah, uh, every switch you press opens one, closes something else sort of deal. Yeah, it's a puzzle, all right. Stone tablet. Looks like it belongs to a greater hole. our way on through. What do we have here? Treasure! Mogo treasure. This is good. Hopefully that means I'll have enough by the time I get back to Leon. To upgrade my J case. <laughs> care for this area one bit. I may have to be prepared to utilize the... Right, yes, there's going to be moments where you have to utilize the douge. And if you don't, you dare. to look at this place at all it's locked but there's no keyhole on this door what do I do must have something to do with this pedestal in the center do not like these suits of armor though rearrange the pieces of course so it looks like I've got the lower right so I need to make these form into a shape huh With this one, there's no particular means to it. You just gotta keep going until you get it, for the most part. <laughs> Almost. Booyah! And then there's still the piece missing, which I collected earlier. Click! And the door unlocks. Sweet! That wasn't so bad. Got the spinel. There's a small chest right here. A gold bangle. Nice. Anything that helps. Alright. <clears throat> what do you have? The Salazar family insignia. It is that round shape, though. Oh, crap. Ah, the serpent ornament. Oh, that ain't right.
Time to go. Ooh. Yep. There's those wildly swinging statues we were talking about. Ooh, jeez, that was close. They switched it up on me. Whoa. Uh, these statues are rude. Alright. Now that round hole here, we use this. Hiya! And now we turn this thing. Let's turn to Diaz. Up the ladder we go. There we go. Unlock this door. And back with Leon. There we go. You did good. I'm sorry if I was. Oh, don't worry about it. Come on, let's move on. All that matters is you're safe. <clears throat> or some other weird sappy crap like that. There we go. Retrieve some items from Ashley. Honestly, we have room. I love it. That's the best I can do there, just because of all the space, so. If it were a red herb, I would have been much happier. But I will make do with what I've got. We got a lot of TMP and shotgun ammo, so now we can do some damage. Radio again. Ah, oh, what a touching moment we have here. All spoiled thanks to your interruption. <clears throat> Why don't you do us all a favor and leave before the audience gets pissed off? Hmm? <laughs> You're nothing but an extra in my script, so don't get too carried away. You're awful full of yourself, aren't you? Over. I don't ever remember being a part of your crappy script. Well then, why don't you show me what a first-class script is like through your own actions? And what, you gonna send more minions after me? Eventually, you've got to run out of bad guys. That's right, I don't have room for bullets. Mm. I gotta get that money built up so I can get that extended... Extended inventory so I can carry all these bullets I don't want to leave behind. Alright. Wasn't there? I'm trying to remember, I thought there was a place I couldn't go without her help. Let's see if we can go back there before I move on here. I can. Good. Got some rare. What are you selling? Ugh. Always want to run out of time at the worst moment. All right, so it looks like I'll be leaving it there. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying what you've seen so far. If you are, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And I will catch you all in the next episode. Later, meatbags.